Hey, Gup Warhawks. Today is Thursday, March 12, 2020. I'm your host, Storm Curly, here with today's Warhawk Watch News. Congratulations to Zyla Tucker for being Daleville's highest shooter at the American Legion Alabama Commanders Cup 2020. She was closely followed by Robert Tice and Damon Jarrett. Way to go, Warhawks. They'll be competing again this Saturday in Anston. Students interested in participating in the Miss Ebony Pageant in Ozark can pick up a packet in the front office. The dates for that event are quickly approaching, so get one quick. The Miss Delville Pageant will take place at the new gym at Wyndham Elementary on April 25th. Packs will become available in the next few days. Free physical forms are now available from Coach Lett. The athletic department would like for everyone on campus who plans on participating in any sport to get their physical at the same time so that everyone's physicals expire at the same time. The cost is $15. Encore Athletics will be on campus Friday to complete the exam. The $15 fee is cheaper than all insurance copays. We may also we have also confirmed that it is cheaper than all kids. Save yourself some money and get your physical on Friday. Now onto the calendar. There is a basic club meeting on Wednesdays at 7.30 around the flagpole. Members and community members are invited to come out and pray together. Congratulations to students appearing on the honor roll again. Special shout out to Steven Trickler who has maintained a hundred average in several core classes for the three nine weeks. Students struggling in math should remember that Beta Club will continue to offer tutoring on Wednesdays and Thursdays after school until four. You probably should have gone a long time ago, but now's the time to make miracles happen. Get there. Classes taking a final exam need to accumulate 300 points or more. Classes without one need to accumulate 240 points or more. The book fair has begun and will carry into next week. Classes will not be traveling to the book fair together. Students wanting to go can get a pass from their English teacher. If you get a pass, you have to have your planner sign and money on you intended to spend. There are two games scheduled for today. The baseball, game will be playing, the baseball team will be playing at Kingston home at 4 p.m. The softball team will be playing Abigail at home at the same time. We have contacted both coaches to see if there's a discount being given so the students can go between the games. No one's on that possibility yet. You may have noticed how busy last Friday was. Tomorrow is turning out to be just as busy. There is a scheduled track meeting in Troy, an FFA field trip, and a JRTC competition in Aniston. Physicals will also be completed on that day. Probably at the landing at Fort Rucker on March 27th. Mass grade masks are being sold for $2 at break. Students who want a specific song played should go by the board outside Miss Inslee's room to write a suggestion. Tickets can be purchased for $45 for juniors and $35 for seniors. To purchase a ticket, you and your guests cannot be on the school's host list for books, textbooks, library books, etc. Community members interested in sponsoring a student for prom can contact Miss Inslee at her email on the school website. Students are asked to do their fellow hawk a favor by turning in any library books lying around campus. Help a hawk save 10 cents. On March 17th at the cafeteria, there is a parent meeting for 7th and 8th graders. Parents should attend to be in the loop about the reopening of the Delville Middle School. School Publications is about to be, uh, begin completing organization videos for the new website that will premiere this summer. Students interested in acting in the video should contact a member of the Warhawk Watch crew. You do not have to actually be good looking to be in the video, but you do need to complete the task in one take. We don't do retakes. Efficiency is key. There is no financial compensation for your assistance, but it might help your popularity with the older ladies. Pie Day is scheduled for Friday. Make sure you send us your pics at your Pie Day celebrations. Go 314. Forecast for today is humid with a high of 80 and a low of 59. Lunch today is pizza, salad, corn, pineapple chunks, and milk. Breakfast tomorrow will be a croissant, sausage patty, jelly, pear house, assortment of cereal, juice, and milk. Happy birthday to Alexis and Brown turning 18 today. Happy birthday, Alexis. Celebrity birthdays today include Lisa Minnelli, James Taylor, Christina Grimmie, and Mitt Romney. Have a great day, Warhawk Nation. Go Warhawks.